Hey guys and gals, let's take a look at the bricks and pieces in Everyone is Awesome by Lego. Set number 40516 contains 346 bricks. So, looks like we get several minifigures in this box. I think there's 11 in total. Now, I bought this set mainly for parts, just for, you know, for just messing around with minifigures and such. So, something I would never figure I'd have to say on this channel, but please keep your religious and political opinions to yourself. Alright, this was just bought for parts. I'll repeat that again, this set was bought for parts. <laughs> okay. So apparently, we get several plates. We get a 6x16 and a 16x16 plate as well as some 2x16s. Now I can always use white because it makes great for snowy terrain. And we got ourselves an instruction booklet. Let's just open that up. And yes, that box is pretty well crushed. <laughs> Looks like everything else in here survived. And... Yeah. yeah. This looks pretty interesting. Oh, we got some tan hidden in there, too. I thought it was just pure rainbow. And it looks like we have several unnumbered bags. So it's your guys and gals' lucky day. I'll let you pick. Well, I don't know because, well, nobody can comment right now. <laughs> so we already looked at these. They're just going to blast through this real quick. So there's actually, there's a lot of unnumbered bags. I'm going to start with this one here. Now, I'm after this mainly for the minifigures and some of the exotic colors. Um, especially the parts that don't want to come out of the bag. It looks like we get ourselves some light royal blue 2x3 bricks. And a torso. And looks like this is bright green. Not dark green, but bright green. So it's a brighter. And we got ourselves a blue-green brick separator. This will make the second one of that color in my collection. And a few 2x12 plates. Great for making frames for houses and such. And look at this. Something we don't really see very often is 2x10 <laughs> bricks, especially in tan. Those will come in handy for making houses and stuff. We also get ourselves a light royal blue torso. Okay, well let's open up the next bag. Well, that one doesn't want to open up. This almost looks like one of those Lego classic sets. Just a random hoshpodge of bricks. This looks like we get ourselves a few 1x2 bricks here. And some flat tiles. And blue and bright green. And some blank minifigure heads. I'm always looking for these in various colors. And looks like we get ourselves a short curly hair wig. Pretty cool. That's one by two plates, one by two flat tiles. Now, that's Jay the Surfer's hair, but that's red. <laughs> I need to find that in white. My hair is starting to turn white in certain areas, so I'm just hoping to find that in that color. Looks like this wig here belongs to Daphne. What else have we got in there? Oh, we got a light blue uh, side parted hair. Um, bright green minifigure head. Yeah. There's a plain, boring white one. We don't care about those. I got plenty of them. Okay. So far, uh, this set's mostly... Well, you guessed it. Very colorful. Uh, mostly just tiles and minifig parts. And don't you be rolling off. Get back over here. So we get ourselves a nice orange head. Probably use that for... Like a propane tank of some sort. And... A green wig. Now, if you really want to get crazy with these, if your minifigures really want to go out on the town, you can have them do cosplay. Several one by one bricks. Oh, a purple minifigure head. 
You know, these also make great balloons, too. One by two bricks, one by two plates, bed minifigure head, a black minifigure head. Well, nothing too exciting in here. Yeah, one by three flat tile in brick yellow. Okay. If you need a source for tiles, this set looks like it's got a lot of them in here. A lot of tiles, a lot of basic bricks. And that's the stuff that I'm after, is the basic stuff. I already got plenty of accessory parts. I just need basic bricks. And I did purchase this for the parts, so... Um, to let that be known again. Now, here's the uh, flippy shag hair. I've been looking for this in white for quite some time, and my hair's starting to become like that again. <laughs> Except with the white streaks through it. And no, I didn't dye my hair like that. That's just how it is when you get older. And a purple wig. Looks like an updo for a lady. Oh, some of these. Are these one by three by two bricks with bow. I got those in several colors. Those always come these come in handy, you know. Especially in different colors. We've got some minifigure legs and flat tiles and well, there's that bowl cut. Make a great blonde wig. Need to get that in other colors too. Give all the give all the guys a bowl cut. And here's a uh, an updo wig. It's black. Yeah, so far, I mean, it's it's very colorful. This would be a great little summer build that I'm doing. Well, this is summertime when I'm filming this, so some of the stuff I've been putting together has been getting pretty bland, so this will spice up the Lego room a bit. One by eight flat tile. Uh, some more of these. I need these in white, so this may come in handy after all. Uh, yellow mini fig legs, some more wigs. Uh, an all brown torso. I wonder if that's going to break. We put parts on it. Will it disintegrate and turn it into powder? All right, let's move all that over there. And the last bag. Now, the one brick I'm seeing in here the most is 1x2s. If you're short on 1x2s in various colors, well, well, this, that's got you covered, as well as 1 by or 2x3s. 2x3s, I don't really have a lot of, so just seeing these in various colors, like you got the uh, dark pink, blue, yellow. I do need these in orange, so you get a few of those. And brown and purple. I don't think I have any of these in purple. And we got more torsos in here. Some 2x6 plates. And honestly, though, it's got a lot of interesting parts. Well, at least this set was unnumbered, so I can just group it all up here and show you. And just to kind of look at the parts, including this stuff here. Great for snowy terrain and lots of colorful bricks. So this does look more like a Lego classic set. Oh, there's some... Oh, I thought that was a 2x4. Okay, we get a few of these. Hoping to be more of those in there, but it's a very colorful set, and that's what it is. It's everyone's awesome. Well, this is like every brick is awesome, and a lot of the stuff, especially the two by threes, is I'm always running short on these. Just it doesn't matter what color, just you know, for making mills plates and stuff. But it's a great little parts source. I believe that the retail price on this was $39.99, so you. 345 bricks, eh, it does seem a bit on the high side, but if you find it on sale or find it really cheap, this would be a great little set to top off a Lego collection. Lots of handy basic bricks in this lot, as well as the colorful minifigures.